wasting time and there's a lot of uncertainty and things like that, you know. Uh, perhaps, you know, we should now hear from the man himself how he manages the money and how he meets expectations. And at the same time, yeah, you can, you can use this. Last year. So customer interactions uh, for, for 2015 is now about 46 million. Um, and like I said, uh, most of that is now all self-service online. Um, and we now have things like online withdrawals. For those of you who are taking money out for your housing withdrawals, you cannot do it online. You don't have to come to the branch anymore. Uh, we've just started interfacing with um, universities and hospitals. Um, in the future, if you want to do an education withdrawal or a medical withdrawal, you don't have to come to the branch anymore. The hospital will process it for you. So if you're sick, you go to the hospital. If the illness is covered under the withdrawal scheme that we have, the hospital will verify, take your thumbprint, and electronically do all the transfers uh, from your account. So the whole idea basically is that we want to make life easier for our members. Um, avoid them from having to do double handling. You know, you have to go here, go there, uh, to do documentation two, three times. Uh, and more importantly, lower the cost of operating the EPF uh, for the long run. Uh, if you look really, the, the, the direction of EPF really is very much about moving online, moving towards basically an advisory service model, moving away uh, from that kind of face-to-face -face interaction because that's really not what the newer generations, the younger generations want. They want to be able to basically get good advice, value-added services, uh, and moving towards basically um, uh, uh, a model of uh, internet delivery. Going ahead as well, we'll probably do a lot more uh, interaction with the financial services uh, industry, uh, whereby with the banks, uh, with basically with uh, unit trust companies, the whole idea basically is to fully integrate all their services with us so that as an EPF member, you should be able to actually look online and see immediately your entire liquid position, whether it's your savings with the EPF, your savings with the bank, your savings with unit trust companies. Right? The future really is about that kind of seamless data and seamless integrity in terms of all the information that flows through from all your service providers to you um, as a customer.